Crystal here and today I'm going to be talking to you about like some tips on how to be comfortable in your own skin, how to be confident, but I'm also going to be first doing a quick thank you and a really just like nice little review on Fermi glasses because they did send me these glasses and I know you're like, oh my god, Crystal's a sale like she doesn't want to be like, huh? Actually, whoa, 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 wait. So I just got my license recently and I do wear prescription glasses and I... I'm required to wear correctional lenses when I drive. It says that on my license. And I also just got new glasses, like just from like my insurance plan. But I got some cute, really cute, I love them, two-toned like glasses, but they don't have the nose pad and I have a pretty flat nose. So Fermu glasses reached out to me and they were like, hey, we know you wear glasses, like we offer prescription ones too, and we want to send you a free pair. And I was like, eh, I don't know, like, do I really want to make a video? Like, mm. And I was like, okay, fine, like, I'll do it. So I spent about an hour or two hours on Fermu's website looking for glasses that I wanted to pick out. And it took me that long because they have so many different kinds. And then I was like, well, maybe I want sunglasses. And I was like, oh, maybe I want pink lenses. They literally have so many different kinds, like tinted lenses and sunglasses and just, like, cool, like, hip hipster ones like this and then I was like I wonder how much this is gonna cost I mean I know they said they would send me a gift but like I don't actually know and so I was looking at how much it would cost and they were gonna be about $40 $40 that's not bad at all if you know if you guys get glasses you know that $40 is good I chose these glasses the just the names and the link to these specific ones will be down below um, I was a little bit worried about like how big they would be or something like that but I literally just measured my glasses and that fit my face perfectly and then they told me the size of these ones and then I was like oh they're literally like two millimeters off like this is going to be fantastically perfect and so I got these ones I love that they have nose pads they're super light they're super trendy they're super cool they actually have like a greenish tint to them that I really like and yeah so literally I just wanted to give a huge thank you to Fermu and I'm really glad that they gave me the opportunity to review them honestly and openly they were like if you don't like them say you don't like them I have no bad to say about them thank you guys and I'm literally about to get into this video right now so being confident it is like the toughest thing a pretty tough thing in this world I've come up with four things on like how to be confident and I'm really excited for like what I've come up with I mean this is definitely not the only way to achieve confidence and to get self-esteem to be comfortable in your own skin but these are a few things that will definitely help so this is something that I talk about a lot on my channel but the first thing you need to do is get to know yourself get to know the person that you truly are and not who other people say you are because for a long time like I have a lot of attitude sometimes you know mm -hmm, self-recognition yay no but um like, you have to understand that like people might call you talking people might call you mean people might call you some other things people might call you ugly people might call you fat people might say lots of things but honestly it's kind of irrelevant what they say and what they think and you have to recognize that you are funny and you are pretty and you are witty you are fun to be around and you have your bad moments and that's where those negative labels come in but that is not who you are so once you meet yourself and recognize who you are as and all your amazing qualities that's how you you like start to gain confidence and that doesn't mean like now you're like oh well I'm this so no it's literally just like I'm not a mean person I'm a good person who sometimes has really bad bad moments and I need to recognize that like I can't feed into this label where I'm like well everyone thinks I'm mean so I'm just gonna be mean like no no don't do that literally just prove them wrong or don't even care about them honestly but get to know yourself so that you can ex like you can accentuate your beautiful qualities you know <laughs> so I got this from my coach but he doesn't watch my YouTube videos even though he should anyways so we have big track meet coming up and he was like you guys can't be negative like all week like you can't be negative like for every like negative thought you think you have to think three negative thoughts like I mean wait no he didn't say that he was like for every negative thought you think you have to think three positive thoughts and I was like okay coach like all right <laughs> and so literally just like drown yourself in like positivity you know so for every negative thought you get for yourself do three positive thoughts for yourself you're like man I look fat today I look bloated okay well my hair looks good I'm smart and I like my teeth literally 
that's what you have to do. And that's kind of hard, I know, and that's probably going to be tough for you to remember. But if you can at least just do one for every bad one, or two for every bad one, or three, that will start to help you, and it will get easier. Because you can use the same ones, just like don't let it get so repetitive that you sound like a robot. Okay, so don't be who you don't want to be. And what I mean by that is like, if you're living your life in fear of what other people think, because you know that this one girl or this one guy is going to say something to you, or is going to think negatively about you, or is going to post about you online, don't be them. Don't be like, did you see what Ashley was wearing today? If you know they're going to say, did you see what Crystal's wearing? today like you can't be like that you can't be a hypocrite you know and like I know it's hard I I know it's hard but you have to try and even if you are if you're watching this video and you know me personally like Crystal you don't follow your own steps it's hard and as long as I'm trying this is what counts okay and I'm still trying don't be who you don't want to be because once you stop caring about other people it gets so much easier for them to stop caring about you in that negative sense Okay, and the last one I have for you guys is create your own definition of fabulous. Cake your face or don't. Wear your jean jacket or don't. Wear some high heels to school if that's what you like or wear some J's on your feet. I don't know. But create your own sense of fabulous. Don't go off the status quo. Just be who you are. And I know that's hard, right? But like me, my style is all over the place and I wear different things all the time and it doesn't it doesn't matter people are like that's not what you usually wear that's not you're right honey you're right it's not what I usually wear but it's what I like to wear today so and I look good so if you guys have any more questions or comments or anything like I would love it if you guys could comment down below um tell me what you guys thought of my review was it annoying did you not like it there is a 20% off discount code for Fermu glasses down below. You guys want to check that out. Thank you so much if you made it to the end of this video. I know it's kind of hard to sit through reviews. If you did, thank you guys so much. It really means a lot. I was, It's just something I wanted to try out. Um, yeah, so I love you guys so much. No hate, eat pizza, and I will see your lovely faces very soon. Bye!